I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. You see if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, completely different ball game. I'll walk away from it and this has been like a therapy session. Oscar Bevis, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by the last Chris Sport. Do you want to do well, mate? You're back and you're, you're back with a bang. That's it, mate. Back and looking forward to being out again soon, hopefully. Yeah. Obviously, it's been a while since that defeat to Mark Leach. Um, see, I know you're going to want to celebrate tonight, so perhaps not in too much detail, but just kind of talk about talk to me about that period in between because kind of suffering your first defeat, I know there perhaps would have been a lot of demons. And um, you know, talk to you about how that period's been for yourself, Chris. Yeah, mate, it was a tough time for me, you know, because... Um, Obviously, I wanted to be out as soon as possible, but a lot of people don't realise I broke my hand in that fight in the third round. So I was trying to get back in the gym and, and get like a date and stuff, but I just my hand just wasn't healing. So it was just setback after setback. And, you know, it's different when you're sitting on a loss. That's all everyone seems to remember. They're just talking about your loss and that, and they're asking when you're next out, and I don't really have an answer. Um, and then, you know, I was hoping to be out November, December time, and that got cancelled. So this got given to me short notice, and I just jumped at the opportunity, to be honest. You feel like you perhaps exercised a few demons tonight. I mean, you'll have bigger fights and better fights, but just kind of getting back in and doing what you do best. Do you feel like, I don't know, a bit of a weight off the shoulders, I guess? Yeah, massively. I was saying to my team, I felt more pressure for this fight than my British title fight. Uh, but it's just good to be back in there and, and get everyone cheering me on and enjoying the fight. And it was an enjoyable fight for the time it lasted as well. Um, you've had the learning stage and you know you can get people who come and tuck up and give you nothing. At least he was out there giving something. And that's made for entertainment tonight. Yeah, massively. You know, when um when I looked at his record and they came into me, I was like, I, obviously I would have fought anyone because I needed to be out. But I was like, yeah, this ain't gonna be an easy night's work. And then obviously at the way and yesterday he was right up in my face and standing out, trying to stand in front of me. So I knew I knew it was gonna be a tasty fight today. So it was good. It was a good fight. It was a really really entertaining uh, three rounds. Um, from here on in, I just heard you say to BT, you only want big names. You kind of well because you've been in a British title fight. That's kind of the minimum for you now. You don't want to slip below that. You don't want to keep having the fights you've already done. Um, it's big names only. No, yeah. I mean, you know, it's, it's big names only for me, really. Um, like I said, if ideally the British title would be good, the British and Commonwealth title that Sean McGoldrick has, or, you know, I want the big names like Paul Butler or someone like that who's ranked, ranked real, real high in the world. Yeah. You know, it's down to Frank and my team, but that's, that's what I'm aiming for. I'm aiming for these big names that are going to get people excited and, are, you know, potential main event fights. That's what I'm in it for. Well, well done tonight. Um, you look good coming back and yeah, good to see you in the ring. Cheers, mate. Thanks for having me. I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. You see if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, completely different ball game. I'll walk away from it and this has been like a therapy session.